Hello everyone, I am Kate and I do my best to grow greater good. I appreciate you all watching. What I want to discuss with you today is something I did that was a bit unorthodox, but hey, leave it to me to do something of the such. What I did was I quit my job. I just pretty much up and quit. I did, however, give a notice that was about, I don't know, two and a, two and a half months um, early. You know, I was going to quit November 31st of which the date does not exist, leave it to me. Um, I just decided to quit sooner. Reason being, I just, honestly, in having to be honest, is not a company I was okay working for anymore, for one. Um, for two, working in general just isn't something I'm not here to do. I'm here to live a life. And that is something I want to share with everyone is that I do believe we all have a greatness inside of us. Sometimes we have to do things of which are not to a normal standard. Whose definition of normal for one um, or the standard that society has created and says this is what is expected and this is what should be followed and done. Um, I believe in living, I believe in experiencing, I get to see this whole world one time, that's it, and I'm not okay spending it indoors doing things that I'm just not okay doing, so I'm not going to do that. I'm going to live a life and dictate my own life at this point. Um, with that being said, um, yeah, I, I just quit my job. I didn't give them a com common courtesy even of the two week notice. I actually just wasn't going to tell them anything and not show up. And I couldn't do that. I just sent a text saying I quit. And I don't really care what anyone thinks because this is my life and I am happy, so very happy, never having to return there again for work. And maybe even so like no, so <laughs> basically, maybe I did it intentionally so I couldn't go back to work there. Um, and that's totally okay with me. Again, my point, my expectation is to now live. Um, show everyone the greatness within themselves in this world. Why are we here? You know, why are you here? Um, why are you here? I'm here to live. I'm here to enjoy. And I'm just, I'm here to have a good time and have fun and be happy. And I've said this before, if you know me, and I'll say it again, that I like to look at life and think about it um, as if I'm already watching it, as if I'm dead and I'm watching my, my life, my movie on this screen and what my reaction is going to be to watching my life on this screen. I want to be sitting back, totally relaxed, just laughing at my life and loving it and tears of joy, and just really appreciating the life I have to live. Uh, so that is what I'm going to do and hopefully you guys can all take something from that and think about when you're watching your life or if that is, because we don't know what happens to us when we die, but if that is quite possibly a scenario and you're watching your life, how are you going to be reacting to watching have lived your own life? Um, so a few other things. Um, this is a really big one, and I know people are probably going to freak out when I'm going to share it. Um, so actually, I'm going to save that for another video because it does deserve its own. Yes, that one will be saved. So stay tuned. Stay tuned for that one. I'm going to have some wraps going on probably. Um, I do love to write with that. I have a book that I've posted on Tumblr. It's going to be kind of like just an online book. Um, posted sparingly, the chapters will be. That way I can hopefully engage everybody. Kind of give some of the, some, you know, people something to look forward to. What's going on with this book um, type of thing. It is called Sass and Kate. A lot of huge inspiration behind it, literally. Um, I'm just excited to be getting it out there, honestly. It's, it's going to be a really fun story uh, to share with the world. And I'm going to be doing more YouTube videos is the goal. Um, proposing questions to humanity. I'm really just kind of exploring who I am as an individual even further. With that being said, 
I do like to test limits, as you can tell from my 28-day water fast. And although doing another 28-day fast is not something I would care to do, again, I don't mind um, participating with a few others and maybe a shorter fast. And no guarantees anything could happen. I could get going on a streak or not do it at all. I mean, again, everything's kind of up in the air. Um, but just ideas. So if anybody's inter interested in getting started with a fast um, or is curious about the low-carb diet, which I've lost over 100 pounds doing, let me know. You know, sometimes it is hard to stay on track with things. I'm more than happy to help. Um, if you guys have any ideas for me um, that you would like to maybe see me do or dabble in, whatever the case may be. I clearly, I have shame about this much and then the rest of it's like we live once. So if you've watched any of my videos, you know I panhandled. Um, I've done some stuff, you know, just give me ideas. Let's just not make them super crazy ideas, please. But I'll kind of filter through and see what I may or may not be comfortable with doing. Um, I'm excited to have fun and engage all of you in this awesomeness in my world and in my life. And I look forward to everyone's partic participation. So if you have any questions for me, post them. Ideas for me, suggestions for me, post them. Please share this video, like this video, and hey, if you haven't already, subscribe because there's going to be more. Um, thanks for watching and remember, let's all do our best to grow the greater good. We're here once, one time that we know of for certain. Let's make the best of that with each other as well. Have a good one and much love to you all.